We have officially made it to Colorado. My mom picked us up. RJ's chilling in the back. And we are driving up to the mountains. We're making our way up to Brackenridge and so excited to kick off our little Christmas adventure in the mountains. Happy <laughs> Hi. Hi, Abby. What is this? Is this a camera? Hi. Hi. You're so cute. Say hi. Say hi. We're off on our favorite little winter walk around our neighborhood. Abby is running loose, having the time of her life. And it is so beautiful out it's like 45 degrees out so it's nice and warm sun is shining so we're just out here doing a fun little snow walk before the sun sets Abby! <laughs> Good morning from Breckenridge. This is the lovely little view from my parents' porch and it is just stunning out here. It's a little bit colder today than it was yesterday and definitely cloudy, but we've seen a couple of snowflakes coming down. So we're really keeping our fingers crossed that we're gonna get some more snow. And today we are gonna go over to some of my parents' friends' house. They live in the same neighborhood as my parents. So super easy, super convenient. We're gonna go have brunch with them and their kids. And then I think we're gonna go to downtown Breckenridge to Main Street and walk around there, maybe do some shopping. And it's gonna be a perfect little winter Saturday. So that's the plan for the day. Still keep keeping our fingers crossed for all the snow to come falling down so we can have a beautiful white Christmas. I mean, obviously there's snow right now, but it would be nice if like all of the trees were just snow dusted. It's my favorite. And we're gonna take y'all along to Main Street and show you guys some of our favorite places to go. Woo! We are bundled up and ready. We're on our way to downtown Breckenridge and it is snowing outside, like kind of hard. So um, the weather has said that maybe we'll get four to 10 inches, we'll see. Although RJ and I were just talking, we're still not sure that we're actually gonna go skiing on Christmas day like we had originally planned because the weather says it's gonna be a high of 16, a low of negative two, and that sounds pretty miserable to us. So I think we're probably going to maybe go snowshoeing instead or something like that. But really excited that it's snowing outside. It's coming down for sure. We decided to stop off at a little coffee shop because we needed some caffeine pick me up before our little shopping adventure. We did have some champagne at brunch, so I think that's kind of maybe getting to us. So just chugging a little water, chugging some caffeine. I already have that. <laughs> but um, we're excited. It's so cute outside and snowing and just like so picture perfect mountain town. cute little candle we found for my parents. It's such a cute little store. It's one of our favorite things to do downtown is just go like explore all the little stores.
are having the best time just walking around, going into all the different stores and art galleries. We love to just go into art galleries and see all the most insanely beautiful, expensive artwork that we can't afford, but it's fun. Also, we just found some nice real estate, a casual estate, put that on our Christmas list, and another beautiful $4.7 million house that obviously we cannot afford, but um, one of the reasons we love Breck so much is because we got married here, and little like things remind me of it. Like We had our going away brunch at Gold Pan Saloon right over there. Yeah, it's just so cute and like wintry and snowy right now. Ta-da, look at my snowman, isn't he so cute? I just built him in the last five minutes. <laughs> He's so adorable. So this is the canteen. This is one of our favorite restaurants in Breckenridge. They have a great little patio, great food. Best margaritas in town. Yep, what are they served in? Half of an old school, like World War II canteen. Yeah. That's why they call it the canteen. Love it. It's one of our faves. We go here almost every time the, we are in town. Yeah, it was the first time I got Lindsay's dad drunk. Ooh, this is true. It was hilarious. It was so funny. Chef Blair J is in the kitchen. We are making, well, he is making some of our famous spicy rigatoni pasta and some chicken parm. Stay tuned for the final product, but what do you think? Is it gonna be absolutely delicious? A true Chef Blair J original? Always. It's gonna be gas. <laughs> it's gonna be really good. We are treating my parents to a lovely dinner at home and very excited for it. Yay! Here is the delicious meal that RJ has made for everyone. It looks absolutely phenomenal. We've got some yes. chicken parm, some spicy rotini, and the chef himself right there. Cheers! Cheers. Someone wants to come out and join me. We are going on a little snowshoeing adventure. We're bringing Abby, got the whole fam bam, and we are ready to go. This is RJ's first snowshoeing expedition. So it's gonna be good. It's gonna be a fun one. It's like barely flurrying outside, but it's pretty cold. It's like 20 degrees I think so we're hoping that the sun will come out a little bit but also we're gonna be moving so it's gonna be you know a good little workout for the day and we are excited yes are some, you stoked yeah some fresh pow fresh pow pow yeah. got three inches we're ready to roll yeah big adventure me too we are off to a great start I already already managed to break one pair of snowshoes but we're off and running. How are you feeling, babe? Fabulous. Fabulous. The wild dog is on the loose. We did see a moose earlier. That was pretty cool, but it was pretty far away. It's like a little Christmas tree farm through here. Official. I look official? Yeah. Good. Nice. Look at this stunning view behind us. It's pretty legit. Pretty legit. First snowshoe experience, how's it going? Positive so far. Good, love it. Woo! Onward we truck. Just trucking along. Just bushwhacking. Bushwhacking. <laughs> Whacking them bushes.
have had a lovely day. We opened presents, we slept in, we made French toast, and then we've just kind of been lounging all day. It's super duper cold here, like 12 degrees, so we did not wanna leave the house. But now we are gonna go over to some of our neighbors and friends' house for Christmas dinner, and my job is to make the charcuterie board. So I'm gonna do that and show y'all the lovely finished product because I'm pretty good at making them. Hopefully I don't mess this one up, and I think it's gonna be delicious. Merry Christmas! Here she is, the final cheese board, looking pretty delicious, if I do say so myself. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas. Finger guns always. Several of my parents' friends are from England, and so they brought over a traditional English Christmas rum cake, which we proceeded to light on fire, and it caused this massive fireball. It was incredible. That's how I lost my eye. I <laughs> we are getting ready to go dog sledding, and I am so excited. I've been once before, like several years ago, but RJ's never been, so super excited. It's gonna be pretty cold though, so I'm in the process of trying to figure out what I'm going to wear and just try to stay as warm as possible because I think it's like 15 degrees outside, but maybe the feels like it's zero. So, <laughs> gonna be a little chilly, but I think it'll still be really fun. So, can't wait, yay! You ready? I'm ready, so ready. Woo! Totally ready. You look like an Eskimo. <laughs> Regained feeling in our fingers and our toes. Yes. We can happily give a dog sled recap, and that was so much fun. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 would recommend. It was really pretty cold today, but Music. honestly, still so worth it. The dogs had so much fun. It was snowing, there was snow on the trees. It was just honestly beautiful. Yeah. Guide was awesome, company was cool. Yeah. It was easy. It was great. Yeah. We all got to ride in the dog sled and drive the dog sled, which was pretty cool. Then we got to watch everyone else do it too. So it was a great, great time. Had a small little group, just six of us. So two randoms and then us and my parents. <laughs> it was perfect. Yeah. It was perfect. The dogs were so cute. They seemed to love it. So if you're in Breckenridge, highly recommend going to dog sled. It was so, so worth it. Super fun. Now off to lunch. Back at our favorite place, the canteen. And what is this table, babe? RJ and Mike's table, yeah. The scene of the crime? The scene of the crime. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers.
on our way to the airport so we can go head back down to Dallas but we've had the best couple of days here in Breckenridge. Had so much fun snowshoeing, dog sledding, going downtown, seeing all of our favorite things and just getting to see the snow, which we're really happy to have a little bit of a white Christmas, white Christmas Eve, and then had some snow yesterday. Sad that we didn't get to go skiing, but honestly, I think it would have been so miserably cold that we would not have had any fun. So I'm very glad we did all the other things instead. And now it's back to Dallas and then stay tuned for our next big adventure coming in January. So excited. So be sure to subscribe to our channel, Bend Their Travel, and leave a comment on where you think we're going next. Boo! Bye y'all. Y'all, I'm out here filming and RJ's just over here creeping, creeping, creeping. And I just saw him out of the corner of my eye. You creeper. Oh my gosh, y'all can't see him. <laughs>